Georgia's unemployment rate is the lowest it's been in over a decade. The state's seasonally adjusted unemployment rate decreased for the sixth consecutive month to 4.7 percent in July. The rate is down one-tenth of a percentage point from 4.8 percent in June. In July 2016, the rate was 5.3 percent. As State Labor Commissioner Mark Butler says, the lower rate is only part of a very positive job report for the month of July. Georgia continues to have very strong job growth and employment. Matter of fact, uh, in the month of July, we set yet another record for total employment, uh, which we are pretty much are setting every single month as we continue to see Georgians go back to work. Georgia's over-the-year job growth came in a variety of sectors. So there was something for job seekers with a wide range of interests and skills. From June to July, Georgia lost 14,100 jobs, which decreased the total number of jobs to 4,479,800. The average June to July job increase for the past three years was 10,600. Also, our job growth is outpacing the nation. We're at 2.2 percent uh, job growth as opposed to the nation's 1.5 percent. Uh, so we're uh, growing a lot faster than the, than the national average, and I expect that to uh, continue to go. The total number of employed residents rose by 3,089 to 4,800,468 from June to July. As a matter of fact, online job openings are up 3% in the month of July as opposed to June. Uh, so uh, everything looks like it's heading in the right direction because we're putting more Georgians to work every single month this year. Employ Georgia, the GDOL's online job listing service, EmployGeorgia.com, showed over 70,000 new active jobs statewide for July. Visit EmployGeorgia.com to learn more about job openings in your area. For the Georgia Department of Labor, I'm Russ Jamison.